I know you girls doing this right now. Put the scissor down, put the scissor down. Check out if you have these facial features to nail this he makeup with full bang like Suji or you might end up crying tonight, so thank me later. Hi, I'm Liana, I'm a personal stylist and let me explain you why you better not do the Hime cut. There are three effects of having Hime haircut you should expect before you do it. First, you can make your face look longer and narrower. Two, it brings all the attention to your face, especially to your eyes. Number three, it creates a youthful, unique and animatic vibe. These girls are sharing very similar facial features between them. They have round face shape or very soft and rounded chin. They also have proportionally quite large rounded eyes with thick agasa. And most importantly, they have this delicate apple's cheeks, which is located right in front of the face. So when you have either large side cheekbones or 45 angle high cheekbones, the he makeup will create this hollow. So this only highlights your cheekbones and break the balance. If you have sharp, prominent, square jawline, the he makeup that ends right next to your jawline will make your face look more wider and squarish. Some people say that if you have a long mid face, the he makeup haircut that ends right here can shorten your mid face. But if you also have long lower face, that's gonna highlight your chin area even longer. So if you really want to try him a haircut, start with only small portion right next to your face and bring some photos to the hair salon how much him a haircut you want to have. I personally really like Momo's hairstyle because she has very large big eyes even though she has very prominent cheekbones and jawline but if you have more balanced facial features it might clash a little bit with your personal image. Let me know if you want to find the best hairstyle for you and follow for more beauty and style tips.